All right, um, I'm taking you there, man. You ain't ready. I don't think I am. I don't think you're ready. All right, you guys, um, I'm taking a Mr. Bananas. Biscuit. So this is, he was in a group called The Big Push. And um, you're going to see it for yourself. All right, this is Mr. Biscuit reacting to Ren for the first time. Now, you guys requested me react to The Hunger. And I get it. I'm cool. I've seen Ren, so I'm like, yo, he's dope. That was a great time to react. But I knew the depth of Ren, and I'm glad I'm taking him on the journey today. So let's just go all the way there. I know we're 30 minutes in, but who cares? Let's just ride. Tell me what you think of this, Mr. Biscuit. <laughs> This is a totally different type of guitar he's playing right now. right now stop this right now bro stop this right now bro we're not doing this we're not doing this bro you're not about to introduce hold up now nah. you're not about to introduce a third human bro this is not the same person yo for real this is not the same person so this is what my brain is doing right now this is what my brain can handle right now we watch three different people. That's what my brain has to do. My brain has to say these are not the same people. These three. Uh, holy smokes. Nah, dude. bro. So uh, just just take I me knew back. this was coming because when I saw this, no. I was like, how does he sound like Bob Marley? Like, how does he sound like this? I, I, what I, the f is I going thought, on? I thought like Wyclef. Yeah. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah, it's like, take take me back like 10 seconds. Take it back like 10 seconds, bro, just so I could process he's bugging he's bugging <laughs> yo, i told i told y'all see me y'all see me make the face i was like yo watch what no. because my first i couldn't believe this when i heard it because i what i was introduced to first like i'll listen to this more than rap these days just because right. that's the vibe i'm on when you get older bro i'm telling you stuff yeah. starts to move you that didn't before you become more mature and the thing is, man, like, here's what's really stupid about <laughs> this. What's really stupid about this, bro? Like, <laughs> ten minutes, I ten minutes ago, I wasn't a fan. Yeah. And now I'm like, this dude might be one of my favorites. <laughs> <laughs> yo, <what's up? laughs> yo, this is wrong. This is yo. stupid, bro. All right, All right take me go. back ten seconds. Let's, yeah, let's do uh, it. All right, here we go. You sit all around. In my hometown People try to track me down For the crime that I did not commit Yes, if a mother of a deputy But I said Peter shot the shame That's fire Alright, yo, yo, yo Alright, pause real quick yo, you, you know who he reminds me of, Loki? Who, who? Uh, you, you ever heard of Matis Yahoo? Yeah, yeah, Matis Yahoo Yeah, yeah, yeah Jerusalem yeah. If I forget <laughs> yo I never got into <laughs> Matis Yahoo like that, but I know him. He, I remember when he had some big singles. Yeah, Matisse yeah. is fire. Yeah, but that's man, crazy. like yo, that's <laughs> <laughs> you be getting gems when you come back for sure. Said Sheriff John Brown, that man hated me. For what I just don't know. 
they're still they still do i i don't i just don't think they're active like right, i don't think he's right. active with them i think they're all cool and stuff but i, I don't know the full history <laughs> who else do you know like shout out to all the artists that defy genre, right? Red Hot Chili Peppers is a band that defies genre. Mm -hmm. Like they'll kick, some, they'll rap. Yeah. They'll do rock. Some of their stuff will sound like punk rock. Yeah. Uh, they're just all over the place. They sing, like can sing soulfully, all kind of stuff. Yeah. Like Ren is just, he seems like he can't be defined. Like where do you put a Ren CD? Yeah. Like what, what genre, what category do you put it in? I was thinking about this when we saw that song, Hi Ren. Imagine being at the concert, all the lights are out, and then the spotlight just, and he's just sitting in his chair and a guitar, and he just starts playing that song live. Like, hi, Ren. Bugging, bro. Like, it'd be so lit. People would be like, ah, and people would be saying the lyrics. Right. Like, oh, dude. And you know what's crazy? It's crazy. Our brain so desires to predict the future. We want to know what's coming next. Yeah. And with Ren, we just, it just seems like we don't. Yeah. You know what? Another one is Chris Calico. Yeah. Chris Calico is one of those guys that almost defies genre. It's yeah. like he can sing like an opera singer. Yeah. <laughs> the dude could sing country if yep. he wanted to. You know yep. what I'm saying? And he's a dope rapper at the same time. Yep. But it's like, man, that's crazy. Yeah, this is... I'm like, where were these concerts on the street corner when I was coming up? These two dudes... And they're all good. Like, they're all talented. Like, look at this dude. He's just in here getting In this world of calamity, dirty looks and grudges and jealousy. Media clowns, them run up here, and they put up with the media clowns, they're not for nothing. Pause it again. Tell me, if I'm, tell me if I'm telling you to pause it too much, but yeah. I'm inspired right now, yeah. bro. So, you know, hip hop, so, so many people say, yo, hip hop is about being you. Yeah. It's about showing who you are. Yeah. But is it really? And I want to ask you that. Like, why can't you just take the audience on a journey? Mm -hmm. Shout out to like MF Doom. Yeah. Or, you know, people like who, Andre 3000. Facts. It's like, bro, why should I be myself? Why can't I take you on this trip? Yeah. Why can't I share with you my imagination? Yeah. Cool. Keith, Dr. Octagon. Big facts, you bro. Know, like, like. He doesn't have the accent that he's using right now, but he doesn't care. Yeah. He's vibing with the spirit of the situation. Yeah. And it's powerful for that reason. Yeah. Like sometimes we hold ourselves back, but it's like, oh no, no, that's not real. Yeah. Be the real you. It's like, no, bro, like let me take you somewhere. Well, and that's the th thing too, you know, like I always mess around and be like, yo, Black Pegasus, that's my stage name, you know? But it it's it's the better side of me. It's the confident Robert. You know what I'm saying? It's yeah. the uh, flam uh, flamboyant Robert, the braggadocious Robert, you know, because I grew up shy. I was really shy. So I've taken people on a journey. But then, you know, growing into this character, you like become the character. Right. And so right now I'm in this transformation, new chapter phase. I don't know what I'm going to be. I freestyle a lot now. I write still. I'm doing reaction videos instead of like movie skits. I don't know. I just 
go with what my heart, you know, kind of tells me. No doubt. Um, but yeah, no. <clears throat> and I think it has to do with the fact, again, that like your brain wants to predict the future so bad yeah. that what you keep telling yourself, the thing that the things that you keep saying, you'll eventually become because your yeah. brain's like, oh, snap. Like, yeah. Th- these words are coming out of my mouth into my ears. Maybe I am that thing. Yeah. It's just this is this is powerful, dude. Boom. The young trends that the comma more at the damn slow. When a bust a trick a finger like bam bam big the dough. When a bust a trick a finger, come on, here we go. First on the na na na, here we go. Okay. Got to keep it moving. I'm the road to Zion. Got to keep it burning. Disappear again, the real world It's bigger than all these fake-ass records When my poor foes got the millions And my woman's disrespected If you check one team, I would have advised to you Just relax If that don't work, then do what you got to do And keep the facts If you a liar, liar, boof, liar, bush, cryer Agent with the wire, I'm gonna know it when I say it But then if you a liar, liar, mouth on cryer Pants on fire, agent with the wire I'm gonna know it when I say it It's bigger than a hip Hop, hip, hip, hip it's still bigger than a hip hop hip hop It's still bigger than a hip hop It's still bigger than a hip No, man, I just had to show you those because I've seen those before and those pop to me. So this started out as a reaction to hunger because people requested. I've never seen that. And then it turned into a little deep dive since you've never heard of Ren before. Bro, that was a that was a deep dive and a half for sure. I'm a Ren fan. And Let's I didn't get start out as one. <laughs> <laughs> You're like, uh, am I su- am I supposed to be feeling this? <laughs> yeah, bro. That's crazy. That's incredible. Shout out to it, Ren. It's interesting too because people kept telling me react to the hunger, and it has it's a, it's like one of his lower viewed videos. Yeah, and I think that is why because he's doing he like the word games he's playing are excellent. Mm-hmm. But if you're not familiar with his catalog, there isn't any. I know what you're saying. It's like, hey. You know, it's like um, it's just like we've heard we've heard Tech Nine, we've heard 
freaking, right, you right. know, Lil Wayne, Jay Z, Eminem, freaking, even when Harry Mack freestyles, you're over here like, yo, I've heard these things. So what separates him from them? But I think what people are trying to prove to me, they're like, yo, you've heard all these things and you loved it. Now hear him rap. He really can ah, rap. Right, and so right, think about right. hearing all this. First, if we would have listened to this first, then you're just like, and now he's like, how about that? Because he was spitting double time. Like, it's like, wow, this right, dude's a threat. Right. My you reaction to the first video would have been different had I heard this, this first. Like, he's not, he can't possibly also be capable of that. Yeah. It's interesting, right. too, because as a, when I do these reactions, if I've reacted to it before, I, I keep forgetting when I got to watch these again with you, I got to see them through your eyes. Yeah. So it brought a new type of excitement, which was tight. And so I need to remember that when I'm bringing people on because I was like, yeah, let's just react to the hunger because everyone asked me to react to it. But that's because they've known what I've seen so far. So that was really cool. I'm glad. So how, how popular is Ren? Is he kind of underground? Is he like what? I feel like he's just kind of. Uh, is he new? He, I mean, I just heard of him like a month ago. Yo. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like I literally just heard about him a month ago. So I can't tell you i'm still doing deep dives but it seems like with that type of talent he's had to be at it for a while and i think he's just starting to shine for his talent in this moment i'm guessing he's probably a year or two years of like really aggregating some numbers but now right, he puts right. out a joint people are just waiting now yo what's the next joint like he has a fan base fan base that's now. crazy so i don't know you guys tap it in the chat let us know if we missed anything um comments now you got to see a very authentic sincere reaction you don't always <laughs> see that on YouTube. So this is really great, man. This is one for the books. This is actually a classic. So if you're vibing with it, you guys need to share this video on your Facebook, your Instagram stories, stuff like that, because uh, I was feeling that. I felt the energy when he started doing I Shot the Show. I was dying, bro. Like, bro. like I, was, I was crying. <laughs> I was laughing so much because I was like, yo, I knew, this, I knew you were about to be like, bro, because I know – like we're similar, like when we're reading talent yeah, and when the, someone's really talented, I was like, oh, he about to get it right yeah, now. Bro. That was tight. It was tight. Um, all right. Let's ride off into the sunset. You guys, this is Mr. Biscuit. He has a huge battle against a very notable opponent named Danny Myers. It's going down April 1st in Denver, Colorado. Um, if you can't make it there, make sure you're checking him out online for his rap battles. He has a very, very high level pen. Um, I'm Black Pegasus. We about to get on out of here. Don't forget to like, share, and comment on all the content. Salute. If you're really rocking with the vibe, subscribe, you guys. I need your help to get to 100,000 subs. We're battling these algorithms. YouTube's sometimes be hating. So, yo, I need you guys. You know, and, and all the people who've been reacting to my stuff or chopping it up, putting it on YouTube, TikTok, it's all love. Thank you. Let's keep the movement moving. You know what it is. 40. Thank you for being some man. 40 years down the road back again. F-U-Q, boy.